Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new around here, my name is Carrie and I am a flight attendant. So today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to be doing a room tour for you guys. You may not know that I actually have a huge passion for decorating, decor, designing rooms. I love it. My so I just want to say my space is pretty small. Um, maybe I'd say like average. I live in an apartment in Chicago with two other flight attendants. For those of you who follow my vlogs, you guys know that usually, usually, as a flight attendant, we have to live in big cities where apartments are not the most inexpensive and the first few years on the job, our salaries are pretty small. It'd be really fun for me to show you guys how I made the most out of my space here in Chicago in my small apartment. If you guys like these kind of videos, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Leave comments below letting me know what you guys think. If you guys are new around here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that little red button and turn on the notifications so you never miss a video. Before we get into the video, I do want to say I will leave links to everything I can find down below. As I go through the room, I'm going to tell you where I bought everything. Any things that I will have trouble with finding are things that I bought from TJ Maxx, Marshalls, and Home Goods, and quite a few things are from there. Besides that, I will do my best to link everything because I know it's so annoying when you go and watch those videos and no one's linking anything and it's like, I want that so bad. Without further ado, let's just go ahead and get into the video. So here's the room before we do anything. I mean, obviously this is in, but it's 9 by 13 and we're gonna transform this. Okay guys, so here's an overview of my room as you walk in. I'm gonna go into detail about every single thing that we see here. Okay, so when you walk into my room, first I'm gonna start with what's behind the door. I just have a coat rack that has a bunch of coats, towels, robes, all the good things, the things that you wanna hide. And I don't have room for my closet because it's very small. So I just have everything hanging up there. And then back here I have this nifty little air purifier. Um, you can get this on Amazon. And I live in a building where um, you're allowed to have animals, so I need to purify the dang air. And this thing goes really high. You can really amp it up. Can you hear that? So I run that bad boy every night. It's pretty big. It just is great if you need an air purifier. Got these little storage bins. I got these from TJ Maxx. Keep all of my hair products, curling irons, hair brushes, all the good stuff in here hidden away <laughs> because no one wants to see that. Next up, we have this wooden mirror. And guys, I just loved this. I love the wood detail. It's thin, but it's long enough so you can check out your outfits. And it's just great. It really went with my theme for the room. Then we have this light over here, and I found this at Hobby Lobby. I loved it, but it was expensive, and I waited for it to go on sale, and I'm so glad that I did. I love the coloring in this. I out the light bulbs in here because I used to sit right here and do my makeup, and I wanted some pure white light bulbs, um, so just keep that in mind. Moving on to this wall right here. So since I am a flight attendant, I live out of my suitcase. So I got this awesome storage rack off of Amazon, and I love this one in particular because it has this um, rack down here so I can put my tote bags, my shoes, everything. This comes in handy if you travel a lot or if you're a flight attendant, anything like that, you definitely need one of these. This is the infamous Ikea dresser that I think everyone has. I love it. I think it was around $100, maybe $200, and it just fits so much. This thing took me hours and hours to put together, but it was very inexpensive and fit a lot in it. Moving on to all the goodies that are on top of it. These lamps my mom actually found, I think from Goodwill, and then we just popped on some of these. I think these are from Walmart. And over here I have my skincare fridge, and this is so extra, but I love it so much. I keep a little napkin in here because one day I found a spider's legs creeping out and it scared the bejeebers out of me. But I just keep all my skincare in here. I am a skincare junkie and it just feels so cooling when you put it on your skin and it's cold. I swear by this thing and it keeps everything in one place so I never forget what I have or what I need to use for the night. 
It's burning a mahogany teakwood candle. I got this little jewelry box. I just keep jewelry, extra crap. It's stuffed from TJ Maxx. I just thought it was something cute to do as decor and put a bunch of stuff in. This is a picture that my girlfriend gave me. We went to Sturgis this year and had the best time ever. Then I have my Amazon Alexa. You can get this on Amazon and I use this thing all the time. So I am someone who loves burning scents, things smelling great. I got this awesome wax burner from Target. I love how iridescent and pretty it is. So then up here, I really wanted to have a wall that was just great, aesthetically pleasing, and something that I could have in the back when I film videos. All of this is from Hobby Lobby. So this just screams me. Um, it's definitely very rustic. I kind of have a masculine taste, but it just turned out so good. Very inexpensive. Moving to this side of the room, we have a fan is the Bornado. I need a fan whenever I sleep and this one goes pretty dang high. Yeah. I wanted some greenery in my room. So this plant I just put in a pot. This one I got from Hobby Lobby and the plant is from World Market. I just have that rod up here and these beautiful white drapes. I keep a little glade plug in over here and it just every 45 minutes sprays out fresh goodness termites so you know these are great they capture all the bugs it's sticky makes me feel better about life okay then we have my closet my very small closet and my beautiful dream catcher that I got off Etsy I will leave this below they are handmade and just absolutely stunning you come in here and it is a mess I did not clean it for you guys but as you can see, I have little closet space for a girl who has a lot of crap. So I just keep my shoes on this shelf from Target. Bunch of stuff. It is a mess in there, so let's just close that on up. Right next to my bed, I didn't have enough room to put an end table, so I got this little shelf from Ikea. It is great. It just goes into the wall, and I can put my phone, I can put my chargers, I have my iPod, AirPods on here, just great. Over to my bed. So this picture is from Target. It is a very good size, perfect to go over a bed and it was very inexpensive. I'll link it, it's amazing and the quality is great if you're into this sort of style. My bedding, so my bedding, a lot of it is from Target. These pillows are so soft and cushy and I'm obsessed with them. You can still find them, I'll link them below. These sheets, I always get jersey sheets because they're just so soft and comfy. And I also got these from Target. These aren't the Target brand, they are the higher end brand but they're just so much softer than the Target brand, I'm obsessed. So I just have a duvet over a down comforter. It's from Target. These pillows are from TJ Maxx. I just thought everything flowed really nice together. And then I have this brown blanket from TJ Maxx, and under it I just keep my Barefoot Dreams blanket because it's so soft. Up here I have a shelf. I'm just gonna quickly go over what is up here. I got this little cacti from Target. Just a few of my favorite people in this wood frame. I just thought it was so cute. My mom got this for me. I think it's an empty like tequila bottle or something. I keep some books up there in this aesthetic Gucci box. So extra. And then just some greenery. So coming over here, I was so picky about what carpet I was gonna get, guys. The one that I ended up going with, I think it matches the room great. I really actually love how this room turned out and it just flows really nicely. Coming over here, this is where I do all my work and it is actually a hidden makeup table. So right next to it, I have this awesome charging station. I have it just tucked away back here, but it has one, two, three, four, five, six, eight outlets. It has USB plug-ins and it is just great to plug everything in at. I also keep a Bath & Bodies, a Bath & Body Works uh, wallflower there just for extra scents. And then I just have my small ring light. There's my big one. This is my small one. This is my small one for travel and I just keep it right next to my bed. This thing is amazing. I got this 
uh, seat from TJ Maxx and it, I love it. I was looking for something that had storage in it because I need all the storage I can get. And then I have, like I said, these little storage bins and that is just my garbage. So in the morning I'll sit here and do work because I needed a desk and a makeup table. Okay, so you open it up and there is the makeup table. So I installed these lights here. Let me turn it on because it's by a remote control switch. I got it on Amazon. Look at that. How does that just change it? It's so good. This is where all the magic happens. I'm kind of picky about my vanity table because it was a multi-purpose and I'm really happy with the one that I chose. It is two-tone. It's brown and white. I have an insert here. This is just like extra makeup for me to play around with. This is my makeup traveling case and it just has great storage in it. I know I have a lot of crap. And then I just have you know, extra makeup in old um, candle holders, more old candle holders, and awesome LaCroix. And okay guys, so that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And again, if you guys are new around here, don't forget to hit that little red button, subscribe. I will link everything down below and I will see you guys in my next video.